Hey everybody, welcome back to some more Crusader Kings 2. Uh, we are... We've grown so much in the last few streams. So, our big goals right now, right off the bat. Our big goals are Egypt and Abyssinia. There is Prime Land we want from both of those. Thanks for the 125 bits there, Alpha Clone. I appreciate that. Uh, we have some... Uh, some really prime land in Abyssinia that we want. Mostly this, in this area here, where the trade route is going through. Right here, we want that, because the silk trade route goes through there. We already have that, which is awesome. So this is gonna be the most valuable land there. Uh, at least the most long-term potential land is gonna be right there. Um, we also really want to start taking some of Egypt soon. You can see that they have quite a bit of Silk Road in Egypt. Yeah. And I want that. I want that badly. Is this their capital right now? What is that? Cairo? Okay, Cairo is their capital right now. And troops-wise, they have less than us. Substantially less than us, in fact. Do we have any proper war declaration we can do on them that would get us land? Either than regular old conquest. Who are they allied with? Some nobodies. That's not a big deal. Now we could de jure claim on what exactly? That? That's a pretty lame de jure claim. We're gonna go on the offensive soon? Yeah, Dungeon. Uh, we're definitely going on the offensive. Now I want some prime land up here. Now I think this little peninsula here is pretty shit, right? Yeah, that's, that's all pretty shit. Um, what I really want is stuff up here in the Nile. Like, look at this right here. That's a good wealth. That's very good wealth. Better than Cairo, in fact. Although tech levels in Cairo are quite good. Is that better than in Mecca? Yeah, they're more technologically progressed than we are. I'd really like that. Uh, do we have peace with Abyssinia? I don't remember. We do have a truce with them, right. We have a truce with them for another five years, unfortunately, which is why we were fighting with like Nubia and stuff to try and keep taking land despite the peace treaty. Because we have white peace because we took uh, part of Yemen from them. That's a prime land right there, by the way. Uh, but we're kind of a superpower right now. We're, we're getting up there in the world. Uh, hey, Incinerator. Sorry, everybody in the chat saying hi to me all at the same time. So. I'm kind of thinking we just want a claimant here. I want a claimant on one of your duchies. Where is your real prime land? Give me the economic breakdown of this place. That's kind of what I figured. Is kind of along here-ish. Alright, well what kind of duchies do we have in Cairo? Emirate of Cairo is not much. No claimants to it that'll join me. How about up in here? That's an emirate that I won under my banner. What kind of claimants do we have to this? Come on, no one that'll join me? I just want to get one of these claimants in. Oh, Jewish heresy. That's rare. I want to get claimants in here because I'd really like somebody that I could claim on behalf of and take a huge chunk out of Egypt with an emirate. Because, yeah, I could conquer an individual county and have a 10-year peace treaty and get one little county out of it. But I'd rather a proper emirate take a big bite out of them, you know? Yeah, I could start fabricating a claim. That is true. Uh, Orbital Buzzsaw. I think I might want to do that, in fact. Um, so, that emirate I was just looking at. That one right there. Uh, the capital of that emirate is this. All right. We're fabricating on it. So someone was telling us before that uh, if we take the... When when the Sheik claim appears, take it, and then the Emirate claim will have a way higher chance of popping next time. It does mean I'm spending way more money long-term on it, which sucks. But at the same time, honestly, if anyone in the world has the money to kill, it's us. So, yeah. Bribe one of them? That is true. We could bribe a claimant. I'm not sure it'd be enough to get them to join, because normally they have the hand in the middle. I believe, if bribing them is enough to get- Actually, you know, that might just be with plots. We'll check. Who here likes me the most? This guy. And how close is he to wanting to join us? I can't even ask for him to join. Why? It's not even on the list. Is he 
ineligible to join my country? Is it because he's at war? Not sure. You only get a duchy claim if your chancellor is 20 or higher, says B Orbital Buzzsaw. That can't be true, because we've gotten a duchy claim earlier in this playthrough with a chancellor under 20, I believe. But everybody always gives a different number with that. Someone was saying 15, someone was saying 17. Ours is 25 skill. Who fucking knows? Because he's out of your diplomatic range too far away. Oh, was he too far away? I didn't even notice where he was. Where is this guy? Oh, he is really far away. That's probably it. Okay. Uh, let's not worry about that for now. It's not really a big deal. Ah, I really don't want to take individual counties like this. Yeah. And I could always extort tribute, but that's not really great. I mean, it only lasts until my ruler dies. So I think we're just going to run the clock a little bit here. Oh, what is this? Uh, my Fizzite Uprising. That's a surprisingly strong uprising, Accursed Infidels. Right, I forgot I should start converting some of that land, shouldn't I? Totally forgot that I have some My Fizzite land in there. Finally, I have something for my court imam to do. Start uh, trying to convert their uh, our peninsula there. I guess that isn't quite a peninsula. Well, this whole thing is a peninsula in a way. All right, we've got to stamp that out. So this counts as a defensive war, I believe, so we can actually raise our vassals on this one. Okay. And put them down, put them down. I don't need them. And I'm fine with that, okay. All right, let everyone gather together. I don't care if they loot a little bit. It's not a big deal. Okay, yeah, this is gonna be an absolute stomping. Don't wait for the rest of them. And some more money coming in, sweet. Let's go ahead and get ourselves, uh, what do you specialize in again? Your movement speed, sweet. Do we have a lead the center? We do, I'd rather him there. And speed, and we don't really need siege, so we'll just take our most talented and go. And this will be a quick win. Right, we're a lunatic. Uh, so this is one of the lunatic things, isn't it? Loose and prestige. You're sitting on the floor of your bedchamber, wearing one of your shoes as a hat, when suddenly a man-sized gopher enters the room, is dressed as a maid, and when you shout in alarm, the rodent squeaks and skitters away in a panic. You chase it down the hall, only to find a terrified maid cowering on the floor. Where did the gopher go? Did you see? <sighs> Being a lunatic is uh, has interesting side effects. Uh, trade post has been built in 8N. Nice. I forgot we were actually building one there. Alright, well, that's our territory, isn't it? Yeah, we just became 50, so we just aged. Let's start upgrading that right away. We can make some serious cash there. Holy shit, we converted the majority population to Sunni faith in like a month! That's beautiful! Holy shit, our Imam rocked that. I can't even move where he is yet, he did that so fast. All right, that was very quick. All right, this fucker. Um, can't really get any money out of him, so just throw him in the pit. There we go. And let them go back to whatever they're doing. All right, I got some messages my way on the chat there. You can murder the Abyssinian ruler, so the true sends. That is true, I didn't think about that actually. It's some little kid my chance of murdering them is pretty low. I mean, I'll try for it in case she pisses people off and more people want to join in on that, but the chances are low. Are able to use spy focus on the Saladin of Egypt? Spread vicious rumors, decent chance of getting a claimant. That is true. I could do that, but I've been family focused for a while. I could switch now. We're not very good at intrigue. Actually, no, we can't spy on them because we're not in the same empire. Or kingdom or whatever. You can only spy on people within your own lands, I believe. Uh, so I wouldn't be able to. Because remember, we're independent. Uh, <laughs> isn't lunatic you can have a baby with a rosebush? That is correct, you can. Uh, who is this? My daughter? Okay. Let's give you a religious education. Our house is at zero decadence right now. 
Holy shit. That money is just pouring in. Someone's telling us, by the way, that uh, this if I click this, it goes through my personal holdings. Thank you for letting me know that, because I actually didn't know it would only go through my personal holdings. Uh, because that's actually really, really useful. And there's shortcuts for it. Hold on. What, what button is that? Period? No. No, that was not it. That is so tiny. It is period. What the fuck? Period and comma. Well, what the fuck? That, that hotkey just doesn't work. Unless it means on my numpad? Nope. Doesn't mean on my numpad. Okay, that, that hockey's busted. Got it. Uh, bribe people who are on the verge. That's usually what I do. Uh, and it usually works when murdering children says orbital buzz. Off. Yeah, that is true. I guess I may as well look into it. Okay. Who's almost willing here? And gets a lot of plot power. Okay, well, that guy. That guy's uh, easy to bribe. 15 bucks, fuck yeah. Yeah, okay, that'll get us the child murder. Thanks for the pro chip or orbital bus saw. I didn't even think of killing the leader to end the truce early. It just totally didn't even come to mind. Thanks for that, that's actually really good advice. All right. Mm, I could pour more into military stuff. I always wanna make sure that my uh, levy is well above everybody else's. That's obviously a high priority of me. At the same time, I like to have a bit of cash on hand for emergency mercenaries if we need them, but this levy in the capital? Yeah, in the capital county, getting more levy upgrades seriously pays off. So, let's get those going early. Time to pay a visit to Jetta. Uh, pay a decent amount of money, local build time modifier increase, prosperity in Jetta. Yeah, okay. Absolutely. Now that money, how much you pay is based off of your income. It's always a very small amount compared to your income. The only reason it was like 61 bucks, which is quite steep, is just because of our crazy high income. You have Nar 2 the second says his favorite toy is missing. I have never not had them become fussy from this no matter what I pick. So I'm gonna just offer to buy a new one. He rejected it, he becomes fussy, he doesn't like me a little. That's fine. All right, uh, trade post, we got that done. I want a small military garrison. Really getting that money rolling. Unmortality says, hey guys, I got a new puppy yesterday. I think you told me yesterday on the stream, congratulations on the new puppy. I forget, did you name the puppy yet? Uh, you can press a ducal claim. Right, 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 I could just press that one, which I'm not particularly interested in. That province is absolute shit here. And I'd be declaring on Egypt to do it. And my god, if I'm declaring on Egypt, I want better land than that. Okay, we're at over 100 plot power. Is there anyone we could bribe to really quickly raise it well above that? Not really. I mean, if the best we can do is another 16% past that, then I'm not interested. Out of curiosity, this duke, is he the heir? No. Interesting. I was thinking the heir would definitely join in on that. Uh, initiated recruitment drive in Mecca, nice. Um, do we still have him doing that? I kind of want him to organize the army, because I really want to have better commanders right now, and we don't need the extra levy at the moment. So I think I will actually switch him from training the troops to organizing the army. And we can finally move him. Let's start uh, converting more of our provinces on our part of the peninsula before we go across the, uh, across the river there. What's this? Titles can be usurped. Don't mind if I do. Invite commanders? Yeah, we invite tons of commanders, don't worry. But, uh, you know, if I can get some homegrown ones, I want them. Uh, tough commander? No. Uh, mountain expert? No. Lead the center and organizer. I'm pretty happy with that. I'll, I'll take him. And I, I'm not really looking to grab a whole bunch of people right now. And who is this that likes me more? One of my daughters? Okay. Okay, I can usurp a couple titles. I can usurp that, which I'd be usurping from the Abbasid, so I'm not sure I want to do that. I can also take that, which no... Who owns this? Somebody in the Abyssinian Empire. Okay, I don't mind pissing them off. So this is a Sultanate I can take down there, and this is a duchy. Got it. 
I'm gonna usurp the duchy right now. It barely costs me anything. Alright, usurped it. And I can divvy that out to somebody to help with my vassals. Okay, um, so that's an emirate. I hold three emirates, so I do need to get rid of one. If you hold more than two emirates, then your vassals start getting annoyed with you. If I just pick some random vassal. Uh, yeah, I hold too many duchies, negative ten, so I do want to give that off. Give that away. You only piss off the Sultan, not the Empress, says Orbital Bustle, but I'm, I'm taking an emirate from that Sultan. Or sorry, from that, uh, from that Emperor, or Caliph in this case. So I'm not sure I'd want to do that, but hey, if I've got your word that it's safe, I'll give it a go once I have a little bit more money, just because I'm cutting a little close. Um, he might go into another war and I won't be able to for a little while, but it's not really something I'm rushing to do, to be honest. Um, okay. I want to give this out then. Um, who do we have in here? I wouldn't mind giving it to this guy. He already likes me a lot. Now that includes, or is it just that? Hmm. Let's double check. Okay, it does include that. I'm fine with that then. Um, unless I like this guy more. They're both fine. I mean, this guy has more land here, so I feel like it should go to him. And it's all he has. He has no air, so it just go back to me. So I guess that means that there's very little chance of it coming back to bite me. All right, we'll do that for now. I'm fine with that. And let's just get our money up a little bit. He joins. Sweet. Let's go ahead and just make him a commander right away. He probably is going to die soon. He's quite old. But fuck it. Temporarily we got someone. Um, I was just telling me of laws of local people, not me. Is there anyone who could pose a threat to us, says Denjin? Well, uh, the Abbasid Empire is pretty terrifying in their armies. Um, they have a huge retinue and everything. They're terrifying right now. They've gotten very powerful, but I don't think they have any interest in us. Uh, Byzantine Empire are pretty terrifying as well, although I believe they also have no interest in us. Really, of anybody who I think would declare war on me, um, no, not really. The only two guys who I think are really interested in me are people that I could conquer, and I do plan on conquering. Yes, finally, that fucker I was rivals with has died. And I think I'd like to use this to become kind. Because, yeah, it hurts my intrigue, but it helps diplomacy and makes my vassals like me more. There we go, we're kind now. That's exactly why I should marry them, get a non-aggression, says Orbital Buzzsaw. I don't really care to get a non-aggression with them. I, I don't even think I could marry off you, Avner, at this point, but... Uh, one of your sons with this person, one of my daughters... No. Why? Age? Political concern? That's what I figured. Yeah. Can't. Political concerns. They don't want to marry any of mine. That's fine. Uh, blessings of the house. Prepare. Oh, who are you? Of Yemen? Sultan of Yemen? Wants to marry my daughter? That's a hard no, because I am usurping some of your land very soon. Do I want to do that yet? Yeah, I got a lot of money. I'm usurping now. Yoink. <laughs> oh, he must feel really betrayed there. So, is that a second sultanate under my uh, belt? Yep, I got two sultanates. And if I have a third one, I can make an empire, can't I? What about the easiest sultanate to grab right now is? Let's do your kingdoms. Did I click empires? I clicked empires. Do your kingdoms. That one, this one, which I already have, um... Mm, Egypt. Yeah, either Egypt or Abyssinia. Or possibly Nubia. How close am I to getting to the Nubian one? I must be like a third of the way. I'd have to usurp the... Yeah, I need to hold all the land, don't I? Can't usurp soul. 
Primary title, ruler of another religion who still holds land within it. So we need to take the whole thing. That's not happening. Yeah, Egypt's, Egypt or Abyssinia is our next one then. 